Hey y'all, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? It's your girl True, and I am back with another one. I'm 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 hearing jumping timelines, okay? When it comes to my chosen ones, I'm definitely hearing those that have done the right work. Do not second guess the blessings, the blessings that are coming in for you in this time. Whether there's a new spouse, a new job. Um, just a new financial level, just receiving things that you never received before as I am getting chills. You may even recently, the past year or so, start realizing like, I am feeling chills a lot. That is confirmation. That is spirit coming through in some type of way to give you the confirmation to go, to hold on, or whatever they're saying in that moment at that time, okay? But whoever I am speaking to, all I keep hearing is jumping timelines. All I keep hearing is do not self-sabotage, okay? Um, right now, I am channeling with absolutely no cards, okay? Whoever I'm speaking to, you you receive a lot of chills, okay? I, I keep getting chills. Like, I didn't got three chills in a row just giving you this divine message, okay? Um the roads are clear. You may even feel like your roads are clear in this time. Things for you are just like you're gonna don't second guess it. Go with the flow. Okay. Go with the flow and just keep showing gratitude so so you can um bring in more. Bring in more. I don't know who this is for, but I'm hearing jumping timeline. And it is real. And you believe. You didn't just believe in yourself. You didn't. You believed in God. You believed in the universe. You believed. And that's the reason why it is happening for you. Not to you, baby. I said for you, okay? For you. Heat of the moment came out here, all right? I'm the Carlic friend realizing it was them, all right? And then TikTok viral. Somebody's TikTok is about to go viral. Okay, about to go viral with it. About to go viral with it. I don't know why that just was playing in my head over and over. About to go viral with it. About to go viral with it. I don't know. Somebody says something in that type of tone, that type of, you know, little beat rhythm. Okay, but somebody's about to go viral on TikTok. All right. Somebody's, um, listen, I don't know who this is for, but you were under attack. Okay. But the attacks that you were under, they're no longer. This person is now realizing that they were attacking you for no reason, okay? They're realizing that it was them. I don't know who this is for, but they are waking up and they're like, you know what? It was in the heat. They're realizing, damn, I was in the heat of the moment. I acted in the heat of the moment. And because of which, you're going to see things flow through because they're... they're they weren't blocking anything, right? But them pulling them in their energy back even more, them trying to, it's, it's, it's clearing out, okay? It's clearing out. This could have been affecting. This could have been affecting, okay? Not that it was controlling what was going on in your life, no. But it was creating some effects and some blocks in your life, okay? I hope that makes sense, right? But it's, it's being lifted. I'm hearing it's being lifted. We're crushed. Okay, so some of you guys are going to be connected to somebody um, at your work through job, your job. 34 may be significant. 43 may be significant. All right. I love your butt. Okay. This person is definitely going to love your butt. You got SEX magic in reverse. Okay, so um, some of you guys may have manifested this energy, but I'm not getting in a toxic way. Okay, that's basically what I'm picking up from that. You guys are manifesting the life you desire. You're manifesting it and believe in your manifestations as you are jumping timelines, as you are skipping timelines in this time. Okay, victim mentality. All right, let's see what's coming out with victim mentality. Niece. Stop doing spells. The present gifted. So like I said, um, somebody was, but they stopped. It says stop doing spells, heal. And I'm getting this energy that they're stopping. They're, they're realizing that they had a lot of anger, a lot of hatred, a lot of resentment. They allowed energies to play on their mind. Think people were after them that was never after them, you know, um, and, and the magic is stopping. I'm hearing the magic is stopping and healing is happening. And because of which timelines are being jumped. I tell people all the time, 
I don't do a return to sender and a lot of people don't understand that. I don't do black magic and a lot of people don't understand that. They're like, you know, how are you working in it? But I understand. I understand that when you you're adding on to that energy and if you're a chosen one, that's all the that's all the devil wants you to do is conform to the darkness so they can use your energy for dark. And that's not what our energy is used for. We were born in the dark. We were born into darkness. If you was a chosen one, you weren't born in happiness with, with this and that. You have to get it out the mud. You have to struggle. You have to ten toes down your life. You had to 10 toes down your life. You may even still be figuring it out. 30, 40, 50, shoot, maybe even in your 60s. Time, age does not matter, okay? But if you are chosen, you came from the darkness. Don't go back and get swallowed up again by the darkness. Does that make sense? And when we conform to the darkness, when we start, okay, they did a black magic spell. Let me do something back. How do you even know for sure that that person did a return to sender? How do you even know for sure I mean, that that person did black? Do you get what I'm saying? Things can be misconstrued and there is lower vibrational energies and entities that like to play on things, right? We know we're on this 3D plane and they will play on people cards and card readers. Don't just go doing magic because you got a thought in your head that they don't pray for them. Pray that they heal so it can just stop. Because if we keep doing it, it's going to keep going and we're just going to keep creating blockages for ourselves because we're all connected. Whew, I hope y'all understand me. Those that get it, just know it's because you chose it. I love you. I love you. They know I really want you too materialistic. Some of y'all, this magic could have been behind a third party. Somebody knew that they could have been in a marriage, they could have had a baby mama, they could have been whatever, and you met this person, and maybe they were in a separation at that time, but they went back with their person, but they may have told their person, you know, during our separation, I was talking to this person or that person, you know, and that's where that evil eye came in, that's where that jealousy came in, that's where that that karmic started to flow for a lot of you guys. Um, it was definitely um, behind a, a, a third party. Um, we got niece energy here. So a niece may be significant. I don't know if your niece is into, you know, spirituality. Just, just try to talk to her about healing, right? Moving out of love and, and doing things in a, a, loving, a loving manner, all right? So much was left unsaid. So much was left unsaid. So yeah, this is this karmic energy um, trying to come through here, okay? Very much trying to come through. Spirit is saying, stop being so nice. Whoever I'm talking to right now, you are very, um, it can be overly done. It's okay to be kind. It's okay to look out for people. It's okay to, you know, be there for people. But Spirit is saying, put a boundary on that because some people will play on your niceness. They will see how genuine you are, how kind you are, and then they, here they come. Here they come again. Oh, here they come again, you know? So that's where it's like, it's okay to, to be kind, but set boundaries, okay? We ain't being nice out here in these streets, all right? And I say that with love, and I say that with love, okay? Healing from a death um, or unaliving, uh, unaliving, they are here, all right? Excuse my language. If you are healing from an unaliving, they are here. Okay, some of you guys, it could have been your um, old lover, all right? An old lover, an old lover. Two different backgrounds. You guys have two different backgrounds. Spirit is saying, let go, move on. That situation is done, okay? This person could have been deep in the streets, all right? They could have been very deep in the streets and just, you're not. And maybe you've gotten out of it. Maybe you were, you know, and maybe you've healed from that. Maybe you've gotten out of the streets, right? But your spirit team wants me to let you know that they are amazed with you, okay? They are very much amazed with you. Keep going, all right? You are jumping and skipping timelines. Don't jump and skip backwards. We are jumping and skipping forward. Onward and upward is our only direction. And if you claim this message, I need you to comment. Onward and upward is my only direction. Onward and upward, onward and upward, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.